Now, a major storm is bearing down on Mexico and Southern California. Mexico's government has placed 18,000 soldiers on standby as Hurricane Hillary makes its way up the Pacific coast. It's been downgraded to a Category 2 storm, with winds still expected to reach up to 110 miles an hour. In the US, the National Weather Service has issued its first ever tropical storm warning for Southern California. Nearly 26 million people in the southwestern US are affected. The big worry is the huge amount of rainfall expected in areas that aren't used to it. Meanwhile, at sea, the US Navy has decided to put its ships out into the Pacific to avoid the storm. We can hear more about that now from Rear Admiral Randall Peck. He's the Expeditionary Strike Group 3 commander and also the sortie commander for the US Third Fleet. He joins us from San Diego. Admiral Peck, thank you for being with us. Uh, some pretty severe weather heading your way, what are you doing to prepare? So as you noted, uh, we made the decision to sortie uh, the capable ships um, out to areas where outside the path of the of the hurricane. We executed this, uh, this sortie this morning and it's complete and they're out there uh, right now. How long are you anticipating your vessels will have to be out at sea for? So it'll be condition based. Uh, what's the uh, what's the hazards uh, that will be deemed from both the sea state and the wind uh, are no longer a factor. We'll bring the uh, ships back in. And, and what are we talking about? Are we talking about aircraft carriers, submarines, a mix of all of the above? I'd say mix of all the above. They really represent a waterfront uh, uh, ships that we have in San Diego. And of course, Navy is not just about ships. You do have aircraft as well. How are they being prepared to cope with this? So the majority of our aircraft are being hangered um, in the hangars right now in, um, in their local San Diego areas. And they're all rated for well above the wind speeds that we expect in terms of the forecast. The, uh, the fleet's commander, Vice Admiral Michael Boyle, uh, issued this order on Friday afternoon. How unusual is this for you? How prepared are you for these kinds of instructions? So that's a great question. Uh, so you, it's been 84 years since a, a tropical storms uh, threatened San Diego. Uh, it is certainly more uh, normal for the East Coast. Uh, but that being said, uh, as a sortie commander, um, we we update our sortie plans every week. Uh, so we have uh, we're continually planning uh, this. Uh, though it doesn't happen often, uh, we're certainly prepared to by our normal procedures. Uh, and when this does blow over and you feel it's safe to bring your ships and your sailors back in, are you going to be involved in any cleanup response if that is needed by the, uh, the state authorities? So that remains to be seen. Uh, we'll stand by. We have a uh, uh, mission set to, to, uh, to uh, support the civil authorities and we'll stand by and, and uh, execute those uh, uh, agreements that we have with the state. Okay, Rear Admiral Randall Peck from the uh, US Third Fleet. Admiral, thank you very much for joining us. Appreciate it. Absolutely, thank you.